Hey y'all. Um, it's Monday. My energy and everything is off because I just give y'all the backstory. Um, my mom contacted me like earlier in September to let me know that my godmother, who's also my aunt, was they found a mass on her first of all it was on her heart <clears throat> then it turned out it was on her lung on her lungs that turned into literally like two weeks ago she had stage four cancer this is just two weeks ago then my mom is saying okay just to let you know she like contacted me asking me for my personal information my social for my aunt's will and I'm like what is going on you know and she's like well it's it's already it's it's spread and they don't know if they can operate because her immune system well no yeah I know I'm all over the place they wasn't sure if they could operate because there's something wrong with her liver they're not sure if it will be able to take so at this point um she's was thinking about going on hospice that escalated to she's in a lot of pain she's gonna take morphine and she literally is, is basically saying i've lived a long life i'm good and that was the trigger to where okay now everyone needs to come by and say bye and so um i immediately drove down uh uh saturday and everybody was there i mean this is like I, I, I think I've told y'all before, I come from a huge Southern family on both sides of my family. My mom's the youngest of 15. My dad's the middle of 10 kids. And my mama is 64 and she's the youngest. So her sisters, you know, my mama was having kids back to back. So her sisters are older. Her sisters are in their 70s and, and 80s, right? And then of course there's some that are in their 60s too. But anyway, she was my mama gives me a heads up she said she's on morphine so she's literally just sleeping and so she's there but she is on so much morphine to where she's there but she's not there so when i saw her on saturday of course the room was full of family members and cousins and everyone was there saying their goodbyes and she was there, but she wasn't there. And so she looked like to me, those you know, I used to work for hospice and to me, she looked like she was actively dying. So I told her, I said, hey mama, you know, cause I always call her mama. Cause she's my, she's my mama y'all. She's like my second mama. Um, And so we all sit by and then we love and she passed away well like within an hour of everyone there saying goodbye she passed away and it's, it's so messed up because it wasn't expected yes she's she was like my aunt velma was 74 but it was unexpected you know she went to the to the doctor early september she was experiencing some pain they ran some blood tests noticed the numbers were off and then this happened so uh, I'm just so upset y'all because I mean again it's something that it wasn't expected um, and she went fast she went really fast hey y'all it is Friday it's Friday and I'm ready to sing I got a little headache y'all so we are on our way to east texas for my aunt's funeral this weekend um yeah i'm doing a lot better it's just it was like i stated before at least i think i did this was unexpected um yeah my aunt was older she was 77 she actually just had a birthday but she was not sick until literally a month ago and it was just unexpected it's an unexpected death but I'm doing a lot better. Yeah, I got a headache. I think I need to eat. Um, so, anybody who knows, you know, a Southern funerals are like multi-day and it takes a while. It's over the course of several days. So, tomorrow is the funeral, but today they're doing the viewing. 
my sister did her makeup and my aunt did her my sister actually did her makeup and her nails yesterday my aunt did her hair and my other aunt on my dad's side did the did some flowers my mom i just called my mama she's on the way to drop everything off and um what i was gonna say so i'm gonna go do i'm gonna go view the body today like in the afternoon today um and then tomorrow, child, it's going to be an all-day thing. I know it is. So, the funeral starts at 11. My mama said the family needs to be there at 1045 to walk in. And it's going to be a lot of us. Like, if I were to guess... Oh, my gosh. Depending on who shows up, minimum 50 people. 50 family members walking in. Minimum 50. JB, you want donuts, yeah? Yeah. Okay. And then we going to be burying her out in a deep country in Tenaha. It's called Tenaha. It's the repast. And I'm, am I saying that right, y'all? But she's having two repasts, child. So after the funeral, we're going to go to the deep country. And then my aunt is having food at her house. It's where everyone's buried at on my mama's side. Right now, we're going to go get some donuts. And then we're going to go to Smoothie King. You can stay in the car. You want to stay in the car? Mm -hmm. Okay, I'll be right back. To get milk with that. Okay, okay. Y'all watch my baby. Ugh. All right, y'all. Y'all see this? I got this stuff from y'all see my car? I got this stuff from um Sheen. All right, now we're gonna go to um I almost said salads to go. Y'all, let me tell you something. I found the best combination. It's expensive of a salad with meat. Let me tell y'all what I do. I eat this like at least every two weeks. Salads to go. If you don't have a salads to go near you, you you missing out. Salads to go is an affordable drive-through place that sells salads and breakfast burritos, and they sell lemonade. So you could literally get a salad for less than eight bucks. So keep this, and it's a big salad. It's enough to feed two people, or you can eat it for two days, right? So me being greedy. <laughs> I get that and then I go to Chipotle and get any type of meat. I get a bowl with meat, salsa, corn, and beans. That's it, right? I get my salads to go. That's it. Now, Chipotle is, is, is pricey because they raise, they, they raise their prices. So, hold on, y'all. Hold on. I kind of want to go to Walmart, but I'll be okay. Y'all, my sister and I. I say I kind of want to, but I don't want to go over there. Why do they want to stand on that so bad? My sister and I are psycho sisters. So my psycho came early. Bunny and them eat a lot though, JB, what I noticed. Oh child, this is white people, white men, white white people in the south are differently. This is a white boy banging and he got huge rims. White boys from Texas and Louisiana, y'all know, they they different. They real different out here. I don't want to go to Walmart anymore. Let's go ahead and get food, okay? Should we go to Walmart? What, JB? I don't want to go there. I'm good. I got one I need. I'm gonna go get. Uh, I'm gonna get the chicken first. What is your problem? I'm. Hung. I don't want to go there. Are those even good though, JB? Oh, that's there's no energy cards on the set. Oh wait, yeah, I gotta just. Golly, what the hell? Why are they out here? Is are they on break? What? Are they they doing crack? What's going on? Hello. Thank you to the papa that the gorgeous room is ready. Y'all, my makeup looks good, doesn't it? Oh, you gonna do it throw them in the trash. Okay, awesome. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm. Bye -bye. Good, good, good. Guys, I just got this Among Us plush. And it has an egg on it tag to it. It's the egg cosmetic.
outfit for the funeral. This is the dress. I got this dress on Amazon. This is what my hair looks like. I know it's kind of dark here. I'll get in the light so y'all can see me. Hold on. This is what my hair look like. Y'all know me, I'm retro. This is the dress. This is a beautiful dress. Look at this dress. Honestly, this is a beautiful dress. Very, very, very nice. Let me see if y'all can see all the way back. These are my shoes. This is what the back looks like. Y'all know me. Y'all know I'm going to... My niece saw me. She's like, oh, auntie, you giving vintage funeral. I'm like, okay. I'm, I'm going to say, pretend like you didn't say that. So, y'all, it was a three... Look, my aunt was a Baptist. That funeral, we started at 1030. The funeral was two and a half hours. Then they're going to drive an hour out into the country and then have a repast for another probably two hours. I can't do it. Because some people in there, I mean, it was a, a couple of my aunts, including my mom, were screaming and hollering. I, I can't, I can't do it right now. I can't. It was too much for me. It was so, and it's a lot of people. And it's going to be more people going down there. So they're going to have something in my aunts later on. I'm still debating whether or not. Right now, JB and I are going to change, freshen up. We're gonna go get some Popeyes. And we're gonna get some chicken filet because we, we're doing big back behavior. That's what we're gonna do. Okay. No, we're gonna see me being a big back. <laughs> well, I'm recording and you need to stop. So, girl, I've been eating like nobody's business, all right? Crazy, like crazy, crazy. Um, but it was so good to see some people I haven't seen before in a long time. I mean, there was at least, not a lot, thank God, not a lot. Probably like five or six people who I hadn't seen since I was a child. And it's just because we never could click up. I mean, I, I've come back home, you guys. I'm not one of those people that never goes back home. I mean, I've been coming back home ever since I was in college. So I just never seen these particular family members. But, um, I was going to say, um... When I tell you my family is close knit, so this was my mom's sister, right? But I noticed that several members of my daddy's family was there. So um, my dad's brother, my uncle LC, he was playing the organ girl. This is a Baptist church, so they had multiple people playing. So you had two people in the organ. My uncle was one of them. And then I saw my aunt there. And then my dad's sister, my aunt Sharon, she sung a song she's a great singer so i'm relaxing with this little thing of margarita i'm gonna try to read a couple of pages of hidden hidden pictures i'm gonna stay in bed probably get up early just because and read spend a good 30 minutes to an hour reading this and tomorrow i'm gonna relax I'm not cooking i'm not doing anything not even i was gonna do a pickup order i'm not even gonna do that <sighs> not doing that um so that's gonna be it for this vlog y'all because it's gonna be pretty pretty it's it's pretty heavy it's pretty heavy